Today, we get to play around with folded paper puppets. There are going to be two steps to this project, and while you can certainly spend a lot of time on the second step, the one where you make your puppet's face, it's the time you put into the first step that really prepares your folding puppet to work. For this early step, we'll take two colors of paper and cut out a pair of long strips. These should be the same size. Lay them out in opposite directions and connect them at the corner with some tape or glue. Even though the strips are misaligned and far apart right now, we'll be able to bring them together through this next bit. Take turns folding the pieces one color over the other back and forth in overlapping layers. The far apart ends will get closer and closer to the middle corner, and eventually we'll have one long accordion fold that springs and wiggles on its own. Glue the ends together like we did before, and attach two sticks for puppet props. Now things are finally ready for the puppet's face to arrive. When we get ready for Christmas, when we get ready to celebrate Christ's coming, there's a story from the Bible that we remember to tell about John, who was a preacher and teacher like Jesus. But before Jesus began his work, God sent John as a messenger to get people ready for the amazing things that God would soon be doing through Jesus. John went out shouting and crying, living out in the wilderness, all as a way to alert people and draw their attention to what God was doing among them. John prepared them and prepares us to be alert and ready for the new things God can be doing among us. As we worship today, Prepare your puppet by taking the time to fold your spring into place as we take time to prepare for the new things that God is bringing about in us and through us and for us.